Let's talk about apologies. Let's talk specifically about apologies to loved ones. How do you do that? How do you apologize to somebody who you really, really love? Your, your partner, your child, your siblings, your parents. How do you apologize to them? Or how do you know if their apology is sincere? All right. Well, if it's an accident, if it's an accident, somebody did something by accident, you do something by accident, jump in immediately and say, oh my God, I did not mean to do that or say that. I, it came out wrong. I am so sorry. Are you okay? Immediately. It was an accident immediately. If it wasn't an accident and it was a conflicting point of view, which happens more often than not, or you overstepped your boundary and you jumped in to fix somebody's life who didn't say I need fixing, you know. Then you have to wait on it. It can't be right away. The apology that comes right away, usually uh, it's, it's just out of fear or out of obligation best to say you know what we're gonna we're going to talk about this but surely not tonight right and when you do after you write on it and think about it and the other person's talked about it and thought about it then you book a time to come together and you say listen I overstepped I'm really sorry I love you and um, it was it was not my intention to overstep. I, I I did my best not to, and then and then I did. And I'm sorry. I'm really really sorry. I will probably overstep again, but I'm going to try really hard to make sure that I don't. But if I do, please forgive me again. Because it's something obviously I'm working on, you know. I, you you got this. I know you got this. I don't have to overstep. You'll be okay. But please accept my apology because I really love you and I was wrong. Okay. So by telling the person that you were wrong, you could also say, and you were right. You were a hundred percent right, right. Or maybe they weren't right. If they weren't right. Don't say it. For example, I recently apologized to someone. They were not right. They were 100% not right. But I wasn't right either, right? I overstepped. It was a grandchild, all right? And she did something 100% wrong. But it was not my job to tell her, right? I jumped into a place I shouldn't have jumped in. And I apologized after the emotions were gone. And I, and I really do, I apologize sincerely. I try so hard not to jump in. I really, really do. So when you're apologizing to a loved one, don't do it unless you're sincere and work to get yourself sincere. Because if there's a conflict between you and your loved one, if you value that relationship, like I value my granddaughter's relationship, if you value that relationship, Find your part. Oh, it's so easy to find the other person's part. Find your part. Apologizing for your part clears up your side of the street. They don't have to apologize for their part. Just forgive them anyway. Forgive them anyway. Why? Peace of mind. Who's yours? Okay, so that's, that's talking about apologies to loved ones. How do you apologize to a friend? It's different because your family mostly is going to stick with you through thick and thin. They might say they're not going to, but they're your family, blood's thicker than water and all that stuff. But a friend, you have to think to yourself, do I love this friend? Do I want to keep this friend? Did I outgrow this friend? Did this friend outgrow me? If the answer to all those questions are, yeah, I love my friend, I want to keep this friend, I did not outgrow my friend, and my friend did not outgrow me, then you just got to call them up and bite the bullet and say, hey, talk to me, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I, I, I was wrong, I'm really sorry. Again, never apologize expecting one back and for them to say, me too, I'm sorry too. 
Never apologize expecting anything, because when you apologize, when you apologize to somebody, they might actually say, "I don't forgive you." That's happened to me, and you can say, "Okay." Well, when you do, I'm here, and I say that with my with my uh, family. Well, when you do, I'm here because I'll always love you. With friends, I say, "Okay." All right. I'm really sorry, and、uh, I wish you well. And that friendship's over, and I walk away. I make a new friend. There's lots of people out there that we can be friends with. I'm gonna make a video on how to make a friend because it's really changes over the over the ages on over the stages of your life. So look forward to that one. And that's your Bobby Pin for today. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. If I said something wrong, I'm sorry. And I'll catch you tomorrow.